Ever wondered how to make your money work for you? Well, you're not alone. Where we empower you to take control of your financial future. Today we're diving into the fascinating world of investing. Imagine a seed, you plant it, water it, and give it sunlight. Over time, that tiny seed grows into a robust tree, bearing fruits year after year. Investing is a lot like that. It's about planting your money in the right places and allowing it to grow over time. But why should you consider investing? Well, the answer is simple. Investing can help you generate more wealth, achieve your financial goals, and even secure your retirement. It's like turning a small pile of sand into a majestic sandcastle. And who wouldn't want that? However, as with anything worth doing, investing comes with its own set of challenges. It's not a get-rich-quick scheme. It's a journey, and like any journey, it's filled with ups and downs. There are decisions to make, risks to manage, and sometimes, mistakes to learn from. One of the common pitfalls that beginners often fall into is the allure of quick gains. It's easy to get caught up in the excitement of the stock market's highs and lows, but remember, investing isn't about making a quick buck, it's about creating sustainable wealth over the long term. Another common mistake is letting emotions drive investment decisions. It's natural to feel fear when the market is down and greed when it's up. But successful investing requires a calm and rational approach. It's about making informed decisions based on research, not emotions. And then there's the biggest mistake of all, one that even seasoned investors can fall prey to. This mistake can cost you dearly, and knowing how to avoid it can make all the difference in your investing journey. But what's the number one mistake to avoid? Let's delve a bit deeper. Stay tuned to Simple Savings Squad as we unpack the art of investing and share practical tips to help you navigate your financial journey. Remember the journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. So let's take that step together. The number one investing mistake to avoid, trying to time the market. Imagine you're at a bustling market square, each stall representing a different stock. Now, picture yourself trying to predict exactly when each vendor will offer the best deals. Sounds impossible, right? That's because it is. This is the essence of market timing, attempting to predict the future of stocks, buying low and selling high based on these predictions. It's akin to trying to forecast the weather without a meteorologist's tools or training. Market timing is a common pitfall for novice investors. It's an alluring concept. Who wouldn't want to maximize their returns by buying at the bottom and selling at the top? But here's the reality check. Even seasoned professionals with years of experience and access to the best analytical tools find it extremely difficult to consistently time the market successfully. This is because stock prices are influenced by a multitude of factors including economic indicators, political events, and even public sentiment. Trying to predict all these variables is a bit like trying to hit a moving target while blindfolded. And the stakes are high. Mistiming the market can lead to substantial financial loss. Moreover, the risk doesn't stop at financial loss. Market timing can also lead to missed opportunities. If you're constantly trying to predict the market, you might end up sitting on the sidelines during periods of growth, waiting for the perfect time to invest. So, if you're new to investing, it's important to resist the temptation of market timing. It's a high-risk strategy that requires a level of knowledge, experience, and luck that most of us simply don't possess. So, if timing the market isn't the answer, what is? Stay tuned as we delve into the power of long-term investing, a strategy that has proven to be much more reliable and effective for the majority of investors. It's about being patient, consistent, and disciplined. But more on that in the next scene. Until then, this is Simple Saving Squad, signing off. Instead of trying to time the market, focus on long-term investing. Let's dive into the world of long-term investing. This isn't about making a quick buck or riding the wave of the latest hot stock. No, long-term investing is the marathon, not the sprint, of wealth creation. It's about planting seeds today for a forest of financial security tomorrow. One of the biggest benefits of long-term investing is the potential for higher returns. While the stock market can be a roller coaster ride in the short term, over the long haul it has historically trended upwards. By staying invested for the long term, you're giving your investments the best chance to grow and prosper. 
But it's not just about riding out the highs and lows. It's about harnessing one of the most powerful forces in finance, compound interest. Albert Einstein once called compound interest the eighth wonder of the world. He who understands it earns it, he who doesn't pays it. Compound interest is like a snowball rolling down a hill, gaining speed and size with every revolution. The longer the hill, the bigger the snowball. In investment terms, the hill is the duration of your investment and the snowball is your wealth. The longer you stay invested, the more time your money has to multiply and grow exponentially. This strategy is not only more effective, it's also a lot less risky. Trying to time the market is like trying to catch a falling knife. You might get lucky once or twice, but eventually you're going to get cut. Long-term investing, on the other hand, is about consistent growth over time. It's about building wealth steadily and surely, not gambling on short-term fluctuations. So if you're looking to secure your financial future, forget about trying to time the market. Instead, embrace the power of long-term investing. It's not as flashy or exciting as day trading, but the results can be far more rewarding. But how can you ensure you're effectively investing for the long term? Stay tuned with Simple Savings Squad and we'll explore this in our next segment. Investing regularly over time, staying diversified and staying committed to your investment plan are key to success. These three pillars act as the bedrock of successful investing and today we're going to delve into each of them. Firstly, investing regularly over time. This strategy is also known as dollar cost averaging. Instead of trying to hit a home run by investing a large sum at once, you invest smaller amounts on a regular basis. This way, you're less likely to be affected by short-term market volatility. It's like going on a long journey. You don't try to sprint all the way, but instead take steady steps forward, knowing that's the most reliable way to reach your destination. Secondly, staying diversified. This means spreading your investments across different asset classes, sectors, and geographical regions. It's like not putting all your eggs in one basket. If one investment doesn't perform well, you're not left high and dry because you've got others that might be doing better. Diversification can help to soften the blow of potential losses and increase the chances of achieving a more stable and positive return over time. Finally, staying committed to your investment plan. This is about having a clear plan and sticking to it, even when the market gets tough. It's easy to panic and sell when prices drop or get carried away and buy when prices soar. But remember, investing is a marathon, not a sprint. It's about staying the course, weathering the ups and downs, and keeping your eyes on the long-term goal. So there you have it. The three pillars of successful investing, investing regularly, staying diversified, and staying committed to your plan. Each pillar is equally important, and together, they can help you build a solid foundation for your investment journey. But remember, these strategies are only as good as your ability to avoid the number one investing mistake. Tune in next time as we reveal what that is and how to steer clear of it. Until then, this is the Simple Savings Squad signing off. Happy investing! So, to recap, the number one investing mistake to avoid is trying to time the market. It's a common pitfall many beginners fall into, thinking they can outsmart the investing world with their predictions. But as we've discussed, it's not only incredibly challenging, but also often leads to more losses than gains. We all love the idea of buying low and selling high, but the truth is, predicting these moments with pinpoint accuracy is next to impossible. Instead, the real art of investing lies in understanding that it's not about timing the market, but time in the market that truly matters. We've delved into the power of long-term investing and how it allows you to ride out the market's ups and downs. By investing regularly over time, you're not just buying shares at a low price, but you're also buying them at a high price and everything in between. This strategy known as dollar cost averaging can help smooth out the volatility of the market. We've also highlighted the importance of diversification, spreading your investments across different asset classes to mitigate risk. It's about not putting all your eggs in one basket, but rather spreading them out to ensure that if one investment doesn't perform well, others may balance it out. And lastly, we've underscored the importance of sticking to your investment plan, even when the market gets a little rough. It's all about staying committed to your strategy and not letting emotions sway your decisions. So as you embark on your investing journey, keep these principles in mind. 
Avoid the temptation to time the market. Focus on long-term strategies and diversify your investments and stay committed to your plan. Thanks for joining us today on this investing journey. Don't forget to subscribe to Simple Savings Squad for more investing tips and advice. Remember, successful investing is a marathon, not a sprint. So take your time and make informed decisions and your future self will thank you.